Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. In my hands is one of the recent releases out there. This is from First Second Books. This is Dragon Hoops by Jean Loon Yang. Beyond recommend this. This is a book of the year material. If this doesn't wind up on uh, not just best of lists, but like award lists, I will be shocked. It is a big book. This is a large graphic novel. You can do some damage uh, upside someone's head. Um, almost 450 pages, about 436 pages of, of story alone. Um, all right, so those who don't know, so Gene is an amazing graphic artist. Um, he's done things like Boxes of Saints, written for Superman. Um, Superman Smash of the Clan was his um, most recent Superman story. Um, his Secret Coders is an educational graphic novel series that teaches you to code um, computers and takes you through basic coding as a history with Boxers and Saints. He's, he was also a teacher when he was starting off doing comics and doing some amazing award-winning comics. Uh, he was a teacher. I mean, he's been, he was actually named an ambassador to the United States, uh, uh, an arts ambassador. I've seen him speak, like an amazing person, um, super nice as well, like super, super nice. Um, if you ever get a chance to go meet him, get his autograph, or go see him speak, like absolutely go do it. I've seen him speak, I think, two or three times, and every time it's worth it. Just an amazing creator, uh, and already uh, at what feels like a fairly young age, has just accomplished so much. So uh, this is about his time teaching, and it's about the basketball team that uh, was at his school. Uh, this is in California. It seems like this takes place right as Boxers and Saints has come out, and this is before he is writing Superman. Um, and he's not quite sure what he wants to do next for a graphic novel. He stumbles upon a story about the basketball team at the school. This school uh, team is really, really good. Um, they have gone to state championships multiple times, and they've never won. Well, this is the year everyone is expecting them to win. So the question is, is are they going to win the state championship? Um, I did not want to Google it. I do not want to find out the answer. So I just kind of read the graphic novel. Um, it is a fascinating graphic novel in that it is part autobiography, it's part biography, it's part graphic journalism, um, it is, and then some of it is obviously like not fabricated, but like twisted a little bit for better for better uh, drama. Like some stuff that was done, he said over I am. Um, he presented as like a conversation at a at a uh, restaurant. Um, so it's. It's a fascinating read in that, and, and there are parts where he steps out of the story and kind of engages the reader to let you know about that sort of stuff. Um, but overall, like, this is a, an amazing chronicle of this season of basketball, um, and, and Gene is not a person who is into basketball. You know, he's into superheroes and not super athletic and did it, not really into sports, so he kind of gets dragged into this. Um, this is amazing. It is absolutely amazing. Um, I do not want to give away uh, stuff, like, but it had me, I read this in one sitting. Um, this had me glued reading it. It's utterly fantastic. Um, just narrative, everything, uh, everything about it was is top notch. Uh, the presentation, like the book, feels like a basketball, uh, which is really, really cool. I'm going to take off the, uh, the dust jacket. We got this nice book if you don't want the just dust jacket as well. Uh, and it's, it's, it's Yang's, like, his kind of signature style of art. Like, he has a very distinctive style uh, to himself, and it, it looks like his stuff. Um, there is some great drama to it, and he does a fantastic job of, of making action, doing the action scene as a basketball. He makes basketball really exciting. Like, this is... Um, I would love to see him try to do like a, a sports manga. Uh, I know those have been pretty big, and there's some some basketball ones. Um, but he just does a, a fantastic job in the narrative and the story, and and building up the tension, and you don't know what's going to happen next. And this is absolutely fantastic. It's twenty four ninety nine, as I said, put out by First and Second Books. Uh, it's out comic shops now. Should be in bookstores soon. Um, there's there's uh, so much packed into this absolutely get it. Like, I don't know how much more to gush about this, because uh, I don't want to oversell it, but this is this is one of my favorite things that I've read so far this year. Um, 
beyond fantastic, beyond top notch. Great, great, great uh, story, narrative, arts, uh, everything about it is, is fantastic. Though, so, highly recommend it. Absolutely, go get it. Um, it's is this is fantastic. Uh, if you're into sports, if you're just into kind of like slice of life stuff. Um, this is good for older adults. It's good for probably teens would probably dig this. I don't know if young kids necessarily would dig it, but teens would probably dig it, especially those who are into sports and don't want like biography, like boring biographies. And, and there's a lot of people who can relate to. Um, he dives into some of the, the more interesting um, members of the team, team dynamics, the history of basketball is taken on. Like, there's just so much packed in, and like I'm amazed that this is one volume, and they just didn't split this off into multiple volumes. It's, it's good. It's really, really, really good. Go get it. Absolutely, go get it. As I said, it's in comic shops now. Should be in bookstores soon, if not already in bookstores. But go support your comic shop. Uh, there's a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code. Tell the shops near you. No shop, no problem. We do have affiliate links. There are affiliate links, so we get a small percentage of that. But really, you should go support your comic shop. And speaking of support, I want to thank First Second for hooking us up with this review copy. We appreciate it, and thank you for watching. Now, if you're into graphic novels, if you're into First Second, um, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. So until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.